And welcome back to the... To Depression Pit. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking of the devil, you can pick that. Uh, no, I'm going to write another Natsuki poem. I think depression's a Sayori word. Giggle. Kiss. Aw. Nibble. Aw. Parfait. Oh my goodness. Sweet. Oh. Aw. <laughs> um, cute. Ha. Let's Do see. Do certain words work for more than one? Um... Yeah, I think yeah, they're, they're weighted. Yeah, they're, they're weighted. Um, um, there's a glitch Fire that you flies. can do when you click a word. Uh, well, it's not a glitch, but it's like a random chance that Monica will pop up and uh, move through the screen. But I, I don't think that happens in Act One. All right. Um, lucky, oh. peaceful, silly, <laughs> shit, sparkle, shit, <laughs> damn it. <laughs> Romance. It's all right. I haven't seen any of uh, Sayori's scenes. Kitty. Mm -hmm. Twirl. There you go. Back um, on track. Pink. Yeah, I was about to say, if Sayori jumps up and down, I'm going to be Bouncy. confused. Bouncy. Um, daydream. Oh, shit. Of course daydream Doki turns. Doki Doki. Swimsuit. Bubbles. All right. I, I think the that might... What the fuck does this poem mean? Oh man, I'm the last one here again. Don't worry, I just walked in too. My internal clock must be off. Were you practicing piano again? Yeah. <laughs> you must have a lot of determination. Starting this club and now picking up piano. Well... Maybe. Well, determination. I bet those fingers are really nimble, huh, But I guess Monica? passion. Remember that the club wouldn't be here if it wasn't for all of us. All of you. Maybe yeah. after these squares leave, you can tickle my ivory. I'm super happy that you're all willing to help out for the festival, too. And I can't wait for the festival. It's gonna be great until I have to talk in front of people and then I'm, uh, I'm not gonna be happy. Damn it! Eh. Weren't you complaining about the festival yesterday, Natsuki? Yeah, well, you know, it's, shut up. Nobody asked you. I'm not talking about our part in the festival. It's a whole day of school where you get to play around and eat all kinds of delicious food. You sound a bit like Sayori all of a sudden. <laughs> How dare you assume I sound like that bitch? Fried squid. Squid? What is squid? <laughs> That's pretty specific. If you look forward to. Oh, come on. Are you saying you don't like squid? You smell like it. You of all people. You p people. <laughs> what are people? I didn't say I don't like it. Besides. You mean by all of you? What do you mean by you people? <laughs> because it's it's right it's right in your name. Wait, what? M what? Ika is Japanese for squid. Oh, eh. <laughs> sexy pose. That's not how face. you say my name at all. Also, it makes no sense for in transla <laughs> translation. <laughs> Oh, wow. So, so self-aware. Yeah, are, are you starting to get the hint? Oh. I feel like that was way bigger than I thought it was. Huh. Yeah. Yeah, like, because I've already played this, I'm reading through all the little hints, and I think that's what giving me, like, the chills <laughs> and the cold sweats. And I don't know what happened, so shut up. No, I'm just not ready. <laughs> uh, never mind. <laughs> Robot. <laughs> Let's just focus on our event, on our event for now, okay? Nah, fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Your reactions aren't as fun as Yuri's or Sierra's, anyway. <laughs> Excuse me? Bescu <laughs> Where is Bescu Sayori, anyway? Excuse me? Oh, there you are. Sayori is sitting at a desk in the corner of the room looking down at nothing. Just getting over to it. 
Disc oh, Incorporated yeah, is, this not, is absolutely this has no right. ties to Game Grumps. Don't sue us for using your jokes. Thank you. <laughs> uh, I, I wave my hand in front of her face. Eh. You're spacing out again. Uh-huh. <laughs> Sorry! I'm back! Don't mind me! I, 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 all you see is her face at the desk. <laughs> Back. You can go talk to everyone else. <laughs> huh? Is everything all right? Uh, of course. No, no plotting going on or anything. Why wouldn't it be? Anyone seen uh, any? Anyone seen where Natsuki went? <laughs> yeah. ah! I totally missed out on an awesome chance to give her a dude voice right there, and then just like go back to this shitty voice. <laughs> It just feels like you're a little off. Sorry for assuming things. Jeez, you worry too much about me. I'm fine, see? Oh. <laughs> Sayori shows me. Sayori shows me a big smile. It looks oddly forced, and there's a lot of teeth showing. <laughs> Don't let me distract you from having fun with everyone. Is this because I said I'd walk home with Natsuki? <laughs> well, all right, if you say so. I worriedly glance at Sayori before turning back toward everyone else. She just like zeroes in on Monica's ass. Just... <laughs> the conversation has already dispersed with everyone back at their usual activities. Maybe I should ask Monica if she's noticed anything about Sayori recently. Since they're preparing for the festival, they must be spending a lot of time together. I timidly approach Monica, who's shuffling through some papers at her desk. Jacob, what's up? The opposite of down, you simple bitch. Hey, this might sound a little strange, but have you noticed anything up with Sayori recently? Anything up with her? In what way do you mean? Maybe I'm reading a little too much into... Uh, maybe I'm reading a little too much... Wait. Maybe I'm reading into it a little too much, but she seems a bit downcast Third time's today. a charm, Jacob. <laughs> Pink, uh, white on pink is a little hard to read. They need a bigger drop shadow. Yeah. Oh, you think so? Reading facial recognition. I can't, I can't say that's I... That's me. Oh. I can't say I've noticed anything about her other than her blood type oxygen intake. Monica peeps across the room at Sayori, who's idly dragging a rubber eraser up and down her desk. What? She's trying to like, she's got to give herself like an eraser burn on her arm. Feeling pain! She's getting high off the burning rubber fumes. Yeah. Just... Ah. <laughs> Maybe there's something in her, on her mind. In her mind. No, there's nothing there. <laughs> but I'm surprised I'm not the one asking you, Jacob. You certainly know her a lot better than I do. Yeah, but she's never really like this. She always talked to me about things that bothered her. But a time, uh, but this time when I asked her, she was really dismissive. Sorry, I know it's not your problem. I just wanted to ask you if you knew anything, so I'll drop it now. No, no. It's important to me, too. I mean, I'm also friends with her. And I also care about her well-being of my, uh, well-being of my club members, you know? Maybe I'll try talking to her myself. <coughs> I can't you... burp for some fucked up reason. <laughs> it sounds like you're choking. Yeah, it's fucked up. It's like <laughs> the diet dude just doesn't quite do it. <laughs> do. Yeah. Do you spell D W? Do you do the do maybe with Diet Mountain Dew? Diet Double Dew. It doesn't do it because it's on a diet. Oh God, that's hey, real life, Jacob. Are, are you sure about that? She seemed like she wanted to be left alone. Are you sure? Maybe you just maybe she just has a hard time bringing it up with the person of interest. Person of interest? What do you mean by that? I'm saying that maybe the thing on her mind is you, Jacob. <gasps> Me? Plot twist. How on earth would, uh, would you come to that conclusion? Well, I probably shouldn't say too much, but Sayori talks about you more than anything else, you know? Yeah? 
She's been so much happier ever since you've joined the club. It's like an extra light was turned on inside of her. <laughs> what? Turned on. No way. Sayori is always like that. She's always been full of sunshine. Sunshine, lollipops, and rainbow. It's not any different now that... Now that song just starts it's playing she's been. going on like a hatchet murder spree. Yeah. <laughs> clang, clang, say, oh, are you silver hammer <laughs> came down. You're so funny, Jacob. Activate laughing. Ha, 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 ha. Have you ever thought of maybe you're always seeing her as so cheerful? Because that's just how she is when she's around you. Hint, mm. hint, wink, Face. wink. Uh, I said too much. I'm sorry. What do I know, anyway? Except for everything I've been programmed to know. I didn't mean to jump to conclusions, as you should just forget about what I said. I'll try to talk to her, so try not to think about it for now. Ah. Alright. Alright. Monica smiles meaningfully. Activate smile. It's, again, far too teethy and really uncomfortable. <laughs> you just don't feel right when she does it. It's like someone trying to be nice in Alabama. I, I know she said to forget about it. It's just, like, smile so you can see every tooth in their head. But, or, but I already know that I won't be able to get her words out of my head. Monica stands up from her desk and walks uh, across the room to where Sayori is sitting. I watch her kneel down next to Sayori and gently talk to her. But she's keeping her voice so quiet that I can't hear her from here. I sigh and sit myself down. I know Sayori told me not to worry about her and to have fun with everyone else, but that's impossible to do when she's behaving like this. Exactly how much do I care, or exactly how much do I care about her that I'm letting this weigh down on me so much? That was written, written weirdly. This is the only time you're ever going to be able to pick between two girls, Jacob. I hope you know that. It's happened before. <laughs> I once took two girls to homecoming. Get on you. Shut you up. Yeah. <coughs> now it feels like I'm the only... Like I'm the one behaving out of the ordinary. But there's nothing I can do besides wait for Monica. Hey, you. You with the face. Hey. Sit down here. Let me talk you to you. I look up to see Natsuki next to me. Are you just going to sit there and keep staring at nothing? There isn't much time, so... No, sorry. I didn't mean to make you wait, worry or anything. It's not like I'm worried. I was just... Natsuki. Just eat the food, okay? Natsuki glances down at her hand, side. She's holding a volume of manga in her hand. That's right. Something just came up for a minute, but we can get started now. I won't make you wait any longer. Jeez. Now you're making me feel like a jerk, you jerk. If something's bothering you, then you can just tell me to leave you alone, and I will. I mean, assuming you didn't feel like talking about it or anything. She practically mumbles that last part. No. Yeah, I mumbled it. Mumble. <laughs> now, I'm probably making it seem like a bigger deal than it is. I've just been thinking about Sayori, that's all. Oh, bad move. Sayori! <laughs> Thinking about her? Yeah, she seems pretty down today. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah. But she didn't want to admit it to me. Well, she woke up and her dog was missing, so yeah. I mean, not that I would know. <laughs> so I can't help but wonder <laughs> if something happened to her. Oh, yeah, nothing happened to her. I mean, the dog is gone. I mean, well, maybe. I Don't really you feel I... like a bitch? <laughs> Natsuki exhales. Well, first of all, Oh, you're like a guy. Oh, geez. Oh. Oh, you should really work on... Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm freezing. But anyway. You're her best friend, right? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, well, stop. Or else more pets are going to go missing. Then in that case, I think you should trust her a little more. If she needed, If she needed you, then you would be the first person that would go to, right? She would go to, right? Well, I guess that's true. Damn right it's true. I'm right. I mean, some people just have those days where their dog goes missing and, you know, they just can't find it and there's blood everywhere and, you know, it's just worrisome. You can't always avoid it. If anything, she probably doesn't 
want you to worry about her because, you know, it's not important. Yeah, that's kind of what she said to me. Maybe it's not right for me to go against her wishes. Yeah, that's fine. I got a dog in my locker I got to go take care of. If she needs, to, if she needs you, if she needs you to worry about her, then it'll be a lot more obvious. Yeah. I should have thought of it that way from the start. Natsuki fiddles with the book she's holding in her hands. She. She really means a lot to you, doesn't she? Ah. Uh, don't get the wrong idea or anything. We've just been friends for a long time. It's normal to be worried about your friends. I mean, you were worried about me, so. I was not! How dare you assume there was worry? Geez, if you're fine, let's hurry and get started already. Yeah, yeah. Okay, everyone. After some time passes, Monica calls out to the club room. Why, do why don't we share our poems now? Before I know it, everything is back to normal. Everyone goes to retrieve their poem, and I do the same. I make eye contact with Monica, and she smiles at me. The weird way. <laughs> I, I wonder what she was talking about with Sayori. <laughs> All right, well, it's about that time. Oh, God. Gonna leave you guys hanging. Well, you could possibly be on the edge of your seats waiting to see what happens as I drag this on further and further. Like, when will the video end? Like, like how, how much longer can this go? You know, I'll probably edit it out, or I might not. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll just, like, um, just uh, next time, you know? And, like, we'll, we'll read some stuff, and might have your eardrums blown out, and, you know, we'll just uh, see where it goes, you know? And, like, we'll, we'll decide to, like... Go with Natsuki or Siori, and, like, we'll probably read a poem or two, and, like, you know, and then, like, maybe it'll just, like, keep going, or, like... <laughs> I already wrote down the end. 